Well, here we are in our real life kitchen with our real life Arlene, and I'm we are alive. making something yes. amazing today. Well, you know, today we, we're going to do something special for the mom, and not only just the mom, anybody who has a hard time getting motivated and started in the morning. Mm -hmm. And you know you should eat good. Oatmeal's really good. You know, make a good breakfast, send the kids off so that their brains can work well and all that, but you just don't have time. I'm going to show you how you can make oatmeal the night before, have it in the refrigerator, get it out, warm it up, and, and the kids can eat, be off to school, feeling good, and you're going to feel good. Right. Also, if you're on a restricted diet and you're trying to like watch your weight, these are just convenience things. This is for a salad you can make. Listen to this. You make it on Sunday night. You put it in a wide mouth canning jar. It will last until Thursday. Oh, wow. It's amazing. We're going to show you those things. So you're going to show us about the salad, OK? okay. Show them that jar that we already made. All right, this is That's finished. what it's going to look like. You can't believe what's in that jar. And it's amazing. It's a nice big portion, too. OK, tell us how you're going to do it. All right, well, I'm going to take two different jars because we're going to make two different kinds. One is going to have the chicken and bacon as the you meat. Use any kind of meats that you and want. We're going to do the ranch dressing with that. And the other is going to be the Italian with the ham cubes. And then our other ingredients are going to be cauliflower and cheese. You can put any kind of vegetables. You want chopped mm -hmm. pepper, you want some onion in there, you want mushrooms. Any vegetables that you want can be layered in there. And last of all, you're going to put a, a chopped hard boiled egg. Yes, Good more protein. protein. That's right. And it's and then, easy to digest. And then your lettuces, we did a combination. Okay. That's head lettuce mm -hmm. and romaine lettuce because that has great nutritional value, better than head lettuce, right. but it doesn't have the crunch. Mm -hmm. So if you make it, cut them both together, it makes a good combination. Okay, you want to start on that? And I'll talk yeah. about the oatmeal. Now, these are little canning jars. And I did this now because this is when you can buy these jars because this is canning season. Actually, it's almost over. So you get these. Make sure that these are good. No chips. You don't want no chips out of them. Make sure they're nice and clean. And this would be the half pint size. This is about a cup. All right? I have, I'm going to make two of them. So this is one cup of good old-fashioned oats. Not special, nothing special, just good old-fashioned oats. To that, I'm going to add a cup of milk. It would be a half a cup per cup. OK, so there's our milk. To that, we're going to add just a little bit of yogurt. That's going to give it a stability. This is non-fat yogurt. Goes right in my bowl. Are you doing OK over there? I am. And you can use as much or as little of the dressing as you want. If you like a lot of dressing, mm -hmm. put a lot. If you don't, just, you know, you don't have to use all of that. You can just use a little bit if you want to. If you like a lot of vegetables, load it up with a lot of vegetable. You don't have to have as much salad at the top. All right. Your family like uh, breakfast? We do, and we're a big fan of oatmeal. So my Are kids oh, like good. it with fruit. They like it. Um, some nuts like pecans and then maple syrup. Okay, now what we're using to sweeten is just a little bit of honey. This is a, the best that you can, you can get, I think so. We're gonna do a couple of splashes of cinnamon. Okay, just some pinches. And we're gonna put just a little bit of vanilla because that's gonna really perk up the flavor of the oatmeal. So this is, remember this is for two, and just a little bit. Now, we get to the point where we want to add some, some um, fruit. The fruit is any kind of fruit that you want. You can do raspberries. You can do cranberries. You can do raisins. They're all good. You can do blueberries. If you use fresh fruits or frozen, you have to let them thaw first. OK, so let them thaw and then put them in. Now we're just mixing that together. I'm going to put some almonds in this. OK, just a few almonds. And how about a few raisins? Just like that. I Natural think I flavor. added a whole lot more vegetables or something in mine. I think you did, mine. but that's okay. <laughs> yeah, because your jar is like really full of all those goodies in the bottom. It really is, all the So we know what you like in your salad. Broccoli, cheese, that's right. <laughs> now, this is what this is going to look like. You have to keep this in the refrigerator overnight because what happens, the milk is absorbed by the oatmeal. When your kids get up in the morning, you can serve it to them this way because it's nice and creamy. It's not separated. It's not like this. It's, it's like really, really creamy. But the best touch would be to pop it in the microwave. Of course, you take the lid off, take the cap off. Pop it in the microwave for about a minute until it gets warm. You've got warm oatmeal for your family. 
And you know, with the weather changing, and we all know it's going to, this would be a great way. You can make a bunch of these, and they'll last for a few days in your refrigerator. And every morning, you got two kids going to school, make, enough, make eight of them, you got them for four days. How about that? This is what wonderful. an easy way to do it, huh? We also have another little cracker we're going we're gonna to show you later when we come back because we're going to have a taste test. Remember that these recipes are available at ctvn.org. You can, you can download them. You can print them out. You can watch whatever. If you want to watch the whole segment or the whole program, it's right there at ctvn.org. Nice job. Look at the that. The healthy version Round and the not healthy <laughs> For the cookery. <laughs> <laughs> the cookie did good. I'm real. Now that has to be refrigerated. Has okay. to be. And so do these. So don't think I can make it and take it. No, you want to make sure that they are refrigerated. We're going to come back for a taste test, but don't you go away because we'll be back in just a minute. Well, we're back in the kitchen. We got yes. our tasters, our official tasters. We're Terry. ready. <laughs> Terry and Amanda are here. Let's take a look. There's okay. our oatmeal down there. We made some ahead of time. We wanted oh, you to yeah. see it. And I've, I've taken one for each of you. And we've just warmed it in the microwave. Of course, you okay. take the lid off. Just a minute and a half. Let's have a taste test. I like how Stir you it up a little them. bit. So you could make these. Yeah, you need to label them, them if the you're fridge. making them with different yes. uh, things in it. Some people like almonds, yeah. some. Okay. Yours, I believe, has cranberry. Mm. I love cranberry. Mix mm. it up a little bit. Okay. Oh my goodness, it is so delicious. It makes delicious. it creamy. Is it good? Oh yeah, I like the I creamy. So I like creamy. And it's oatmeal. so easy. It's such mm, an easy thing. I like it easy too. Now here's our salad. Oh yeah. And look, look, this is what came out of that. Can you imagine? Oh, look how that's great. enough for two people, really. Yes, yeah, that's true. And uh, you don't have to make it that full. But what you have to do is make sure you wipe this clean, and you have to use a canning jar that will not hold for four days. You can taste that if you want. Well, There's wait, a chicken. Wait, like, so you, you can put it back, of whatever you don't eat, you can put back well, in the jar? Well, I, what I would do is try to take just so much out. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. You know, and then I don't, you know, so, okay. And then what we made also were these Ritz crackers. We didn't get to show you. Is that good? good? Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah, we didn't get to show you, but it's on uh, our website. It's ctvn.org. You want to go there. And these are just Ritz crackers that we've just put a little bit of, just taste that. This will oh, be yeah. great. Mm. Here, help yourself. Yeah, I don't mean to. Oh, no, no. This is but this will be great to even package up in some little Ziplocs and put it with your salad. What did you mean? Be. You just mixed mm. it with something? Yeah, just put some um, ranch dressing dry mm -hmm. and uh, some uh, melted butter and um, some Parmesan cheese. Oh, wow. This Isn't is that nice? Very good. These are nice for snack, even mm -hmm. for soup. Oh, this is yeah, great. I was thinking I'm too. Thinking. Even get a smaller jar, maybe half that yeah. size, and do single serving for oh, lunches. Yeah. Well, at the work. thing is too that you want to use the the um, wide mouth because you can't right. get it out if you right. have that little skinny. That's right. I mean, well, that would be hard. Thank you. This is yummy. In good. just a moment, we'll be praying for you and for all of those who've been calling our ministry yes. center with their prayer requests. Yes. But first, let's see what's coming up tomorrow on Real Life. Real Life.